How's it going guys? Welcome to your Emerald's Landscape YouTube channel. In today's video, we are doing a side-by-side -side comparison of two mowers, the Hustler X1 16-inch side discharge versus the Walker B23i Northwest Edition 48-inch side discharge deck. Now, right off the bat, we already know this is not going to be a fair comparison. We just want to showcase how well each mower does with its capabilities and what are on there. Uh, in tall, th thick, wet grass, it's been a few weeks since we've actually cut this lawn. This is the old Emerald's Landscaping testing grounds. So the grass is really long and of course it just rained a little bit ago so it's slightly damped as well. Uh, right off the bat I'll showcase you know of course the Northwest has a 23 horsepower engine while the Hustler X1 has a 27 horsepower engine of course one's a 60 inch and one's a 48 inch. So we know that this is not a fair comparison and this is also not a video to either bash either one mower. Each one is made specifically for a certain purpose, so I wanted to uh, you know, say that right off the bat. Of course, we have my lovely wife. She will be the operator on the mowers. So anyway, so we're gonna be doing a few passes and seeing how well the cut does in about, some of this grass is about four to six inches long, and like I said, it has, it's, it's wet. So we'll, we'll see how each one does and go from there. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright guys, so we are currently here at my property and just to make sure that we are not beating up on Walker, which I do have right here, we are at my property, I think I just mentioned that, and so we're going to be mowing my grass. This grass is a lot drier. It's in some areas, like this section right here, it's a little bit thicker, uh, but I want to show you guys the difference in cut from this compared to uh, the other property that we did. And like I said, I want to make sure that I'm not beating up on Walker and I want to show that this mower is specifically made for properties like this where you're mowing weekly. They're higher end properties and they're not meant for that really rough stuff. So let me show you the cut real quick. I'm gonna do a couple passes and uh, that's basically it. Let's get started. <laughs>
right, guys, so we are all done. So as you guys can tell, uh, this mower does so much better. You can tell that it's a really, really nice cut in this type of grass. And the reason why I want to continue this video was to show you guys it, that I'm not harping on Walker saying that it's a crappy mower because this is a great mower. And the one thing I do love about this is the deck. Uh, not only that it folds up, but it does have that true floating deck where you're getting a really good cut. And this is actually fairly flat because I actually graded all this myself with my tractor. Uh, but a lot of properties will typically have dips and stuff. And with this being a 48 inch, it helps. But the 60 inch, sometimes they'll scalp in those those little dips and it doesn't follow the terrain a lot or very well. Uh, but this thing does look really good. Let me turn the camera around so I can show you guys even more because it's amazing. So this is like the final result. Um, of course, granted that the grass was pretty tall, especially in this section. And the reason why it was really tall in this section was because when we were doing some mowings recently or some videos of the Y Bravo and also the Wabang mower, uh, my wife, she was the one doing it. And we only went to about right here because right here, you guys can see it, we hit all rocks. So the grass was really tall, as you guys can see underneath the right there. So that's how tall it was. So that's why this grass up here is a lot thicker. Um, and there's just so much more, ah, oh, whatever, debris than there is over here. But like I said, a way better cut. And let me zoom in. See, look at that cut. I mean, there's barely anything. You might have one or two strands here and there, but overall, it's just a really beautiful cut. Uh, so like I said, want to make sure that I was clear about that. Thanks, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. Uh, let me know in the comments down below which mower you guys would rather choose, whether the Hustler X1 or the Walker. And I would love to hear what you guys have to say. Hope you guys enjoy this. Be sure to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time on Ambrose Landscaping.